Hey, it's Kendall, and this is 90 Second Church. Before we begin, if you haven't done so already, please follow us on Facebook or subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can catch the next episode. We are in a series called You Want Me to Do What? And we're challenging each other to take tangible steps of faith every week in the lives of those around us. So this week's challenge, share a meal with someone new. Now, I know we're all doing Thanksgiving this week, so let's extend it maybe sometime over the next couple weeks. All right, grab coffee or lunch with somebody you haven't done that with from our church or from work or a neighbor and, and just get to know them a little bit. Our passage for the week is Deuteronomy 16 verses 14 and 15 in which God commands the Israelites to have a feast. I mean, talk about a great command. I command you to eat together. Okay, I can do that. And we're actually going to go through the passage backward. And so today I want to take just the last sentence of verse 15. This is what it says. This festival will be a time of great joy for all. That's it. This festival will be a time of great joy for all. Now here's what I want to notice. How do followers of Jesus eat I bet you that's a question you never asked before, right? How do followers of Jesus eat? Well, we eat with great joy because it is the heart of God to enjoy, to enjoy life, to enjoy friends, to enjoy food. You know, I wonder if sometimes we have the impression that as we follow Jesus, we have to get more somber and things go from color to, to black and white. But actually, the opposite is true. The closer we get to God, the deeper and the greater our joy. And the further we go into God's heart, the more richly we experience his life, including the food we eat. <laughs> Here's the thing, though. Joy can only be experienced as I am fully present and engaged in the moment before me. In other words, the more distracted I am, the less joy I will find. To put it another way, a biblical theology of food entails being present. Present to God, present to others at the table, and even present to the food in front of me. So, share a table with someone new and give them all your attention. We'll talk to you soon.